like no kind of message to say um i'm real sorry um or something you know we have plans today right you you, you know what i got stuff to do and i kind of scheduled everything around the Hey guys welcome back to my channel so it's tuesday welcome back to another vlog girl be sure to like comment and subscribe like before you leave this vlog be sure to subscribe um so currently it's like tuesday afternoon it's like 12 o'clock right now um i'm at ulta i need setting spray like my face i don't know i've just been annoyed with how my makeup's been turning out because i've been out of setting spray so i pulled up to this ulta it's like 15 minutes from my house so this is where we are going today i'm gonna see if they have the setting spray that i need also i'm out of like shampoo and conditioner and i use this specific one that is sold in ulta so i'm gonna get that and also i'm going to the mall i don't really like going to the mall but i have to see if i can get like some sneakers so i'm going to the mall going to ulta um i need to grab something to eat because i really didn't have any breakfast this morning i was editing so i didn't eat so you know i'm not doing that great right now i'm so hungry um but yeah guys let me turn this car off let's go we're going to ulta and i'm gonna see where else i go today because i feel like i have a few things to get on the road Guys, this is the conditioner and shampoo that I use. It's a little bit more pricey than my regular stuff that I would use, but this is what I've been using. It's like $13 for the shampoo with the conditioner. Cost you like $28 or so. Well, with tax, just say $30. But this is really good. Um, they do have the bigger ones I was contemplating, but the bigger ones are here, $25 a pop, but then I mean, I would not have to come back anytime soon. I'm trying to think. So that's like $50, girl. You know what? I think I'll get the small shampoo and then get the bigger conditioner. How about that? Yeah, because I use more conditioner than shampoo anyways. And this one is damaged, so we're not getting that. See? Y'all, I've seen that there was a big TJ Maxx, so I'm just gonna go inside to see if I see anything. I already know these stores be doing me dirty, but I might find something, so we're just gonna check that out real quick, just in case, and I think I'm gonna go to Best Buy. I'm really trying to go everywhere. TJ Maxx had nothing. I don't know what I expected to see anyways. Um, I just pulled up to Best Buy. It's raining. I have to go in and see if they have the iPad that I was looking at for my son. He told me he wanted an iPad for his birthday. So I'm going to see if they have it. It's like coming down so hard, oh my God. But I'm just gonna wait on this rain to stop. And then I'm gonna go to Best Buy, see if I get this iPad. And they showed me that there was um, a Chick-fil-A close to here. So I'm gonna go to Chick-fil-A and then we're gonna go to the mall because i have to go to the stores over there to see if i get the sneakers that i was trying to get for my son i really rather buying online but it's not really working out for the time frame that i need it for so i have to go in the store maybe i should just run no no not a good idea not a good idea y'all i'm home i bought another palm this time this one is from home depot with home depot you can like return it the lady said it can go outside um i literally just need to water it so i'm gonna put it outside when i showed her my ikea plant she's like it's literally the same thing so i'm gonna put both of them outside y'all 
this is the one from Ikea, right? Um, this the one from... This the one from... Where the hell did I go? This the one from Home Depot that I just got. Guys, I did get the iPad. I got the iPad Air because besides that, they only have the iPad, the 8th generation, and that still has the button. This one is more new, but this is really nice. I love how it looks, and I got the blue, I think. Oh my God, don't drop it again, Kimberly. Yeah, I got the blue color. Not gonna open it because I'm just gonna send it like this, so I won't open it. I'll be seeing the same things, but I saw these. I love these. I had to get these for him. These are so dope, definitely. Um, I didn't really see anything else I like. Half of the stuff that I've seen, I already bought before. So I'm just trying to see if I find anything else. But I love these shoes. Guys, and at Ulta, I got the shampoo and the conditioner. See, I just got the big conditioner because the condition it's like 25, y'all. So I just got a conditioner for 25, the big one. And I just got the regular size shampoo. This is like $13, $13.50 or something like that. So... I don't use that much shampoo and I still have some so I did that I got two of my setting sprays because we was really ghetto out here not setting or faces um ooh, I got wow and I got some brow product this is the morphe um this is their brow cream yeah so I got two of those and I got a pencil and that's pretty much it. I just checked my email and my coffee table is coming early. I'm super excited about that. And I was going to change my vlogging camera today. They did not have the camera that I wanted. The guy was like, do you want me to order it? And I'm just like, oh, might as well. I just order it at my house because it's the same difference. So I didn't take it. I just bought the iPad and that was it for bed. Um, I'm going to lunch with this other influencer. She's like on instagram my sis just made it to 100k like i met her online we've never like gone out or anything but I, I used to like talk to her online and i met her one time like years ago before she was just like an influencer when she was like at sephora and i was not an influencer then i was not even thinking about this so it's kind of crazy how we both grew and we we're both doing this and she just made it to 100k on instagram so that's lit so i hit her up and i was just like you want to go to lunch and she's like girl yes and i'm like okay because I don't really go anywhere guys i don't have friends like that here i mean i'm not from here so i really don't have friends like that here my friends that i used to have um they don't live here anymore and yeah my friend moved just so annoying so it's literally just me and if my sister or tiana and then tiana is always working and my sister right now is on vacation so yeah my options are very limited right now. I'm just like, I'm tired of being inside and I wanna go and do something. I literally was gonna go to lunch by myself this week. That's just the point that I've gotten to. I'm just like, you know what? I wanna go eat and I just wanna be outside. So I feel like I might go to lunch by myself. And then I remembered that um, she's in Florida. I'm just like, why don't we just like go to lunch then? So I hit her up and she's like, yeah, she wanna go to lunch. So tomorrow, I think we're going to lunch. I hope we're going to lunch because that's gonna be nice and she wanted to go to Miami So I'm just like, okay girl, so that might be something. So yeah guys so i just got done working out i'm going to duncan why is there a big ass line to go to duncan donuts like it's not even that early oh my god Silly. 
Bro, I be cussing. I like I literally be out here driving and just cussing. Like I'm not trying to do that anymore, God. I'm sorry. Um yeah. Pulled up into Duncan. It's a long it's a really long line. Like, why is everybody here? What time is it? It's like 10 o'clock. Aren't y'all at work or something? Like, why are y'all here? I just want to know why everybody's at Dunkin' Donuts. Like, we've been in this line for a minute. And then there's mad people behind me, too. Like, what's going on? But, any um, she said that tomorrow would be better. So, I'm just like, alright, bet. I have stuff to do anyway. So, I just went and I worked out instead. And then I'm getting breakfast and then I'm gonna go do my hair. And that's it. And then, tomorrow we're going to lunch. So, I need to decide now if I'm doing the butterfly locks or a wig y'all tell me because today i was gonna use this hair like this wig that i installed but since we're no longer going and i have work to do i'm about to take this hair out because you know time is money i have to take this out and do something else um yeah hold on i think we're moving damn let me tell you how I see some scratches on my car, right? And I'm just like, did somebody key my car? Well, not. it's not like bad, like somebody keyed your car, but I just be noticing mad scratches on my car. And I'm just like, am I parking too close to people's cars or what am I doing? But I'm the kind of person, like I'm so anal about everything. Like if I go in the parking spot and it's close, I get out and I be doing it like three, four times until I'm like in the center where I'm far away from somebody's car. So I, I don't know what's been going on. Like the driver's side of my car has some scratches that I don't understand. I did not do that. I don't know who did that because I didn't do that. <gasps> okay, no, this is ghetto. I think you guys have to go back over here. Because that's about to break my break my camera let me take my seatbelt off good morning how can i help you good morning can i have a medium caramel iced coffee with four creams and three pumps of caramel syrup four cream how many pumps of caramel three three and you don't want two sugar no sugar okay you would like something else yes can i have a chicken um bacon and cheese croissant you like something else? Uh, and uh, donut. Uh, is it raspberry? The, those donuts you have? You want blueberry donut? No, raspberry. We don't have raspberry donut. We have blueberry. I never heard of you guys. The one that's the you guys have the raspberries on the red filling, right? That's the one that you sell. Jelly. Yeah, that's well. That's the one I want then. Okay, so you want one jelly? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Do you like something else? No, that's it. Thank you. Okay, thanks. Sorry, what the hell? Lord, please don't let me ride this curb. Y'all. I rode the curb at Best Buy yesterday. Like, when I tell you, I don't know what was happening. I was just trying to get around a car. Get around um a car because it was coming in. Shit, hold on. Tell me why I rode the curb. Like, I'm like, oh my god, this is so embarrassing. I hate when that happens to me. Like, I literally was trying to go around the corner, trying to get in front of the car before it came and rode the curb. That was dumb. Like, that was dumb. I'm like, oh my god, I hope nobody sees me. <laughs> I just drove away. Wow. So it's Friday, I have not been checking in, but I wanted to hop on here real quick to let y'all know that my coffee table got delivered. Like I ordered the coffee table last Sunday and I thought it was gonna be delivered um, like next week, but it came early, but they dropped it off at the clubhouse where you pick up like your packages and stuff. But I really don't think they should have done that because I can't lift that up. I went by the clubhouse and um, the manager just told me to leave it he's gonna get like some of the maintenance guys to bring it up for me so i'm waiting on that so the coffee table is here i'm excited because i want to see how it goes with the sofa i mean i wish i had the rug to like spread the rug out first but the rug is not yet in 
not yet available i ordered it even though it was back ordered and they say uh i think the third or something like that of august is when it's gonna be in stock we're still in july but this is the last like a couple days in july so i hope by next week i get some kind of information about the rug because girl we've been waiting on the rug for a while now but yeah i'm gonna see how this coffee table goes i'll show y'all that and yeah i really haven't been doing anything much i'm sorry that's why i haven't been on here i went to the gym this morning um that's about it i went to target i didn't do anything else and i know i was supposed to go to lunch girl that was the situation because i mean um I reached out to the person more than one time and I'm just like, you know what, screw it. Because I initiated going to lunch and she was all for going to lunch and I'm just like, yeah, let's go. Boom, the day off, she's just like, her jacket got messed up. I'm like, I bet, I get it. And I'm just like, can you wear something else? And she's like, that's what you wanna wear. So I'm just like, okay. And she's like, let's do it the day afterwards. Boom, no problem. I was super happy still because I, I wanna go to lunch. I mean, I do wanna get out. And then, boom, um, yesterday, I got up, no message. I'm just like, all right, what time are we meeting up? Nothing like the whole day. And I kind of just sat around in the morning trying to get my, you know, trying to get my morning started. I didn't really do anything much because I was waiting on this person. Cause I don't want to start like doing stuff. And then she's just like, hey, like, you know, let's go. So I waited, no message. Girl, up to like last, like yesterday evening, I didn't get a message. And this morning I checked my Instagram in the evening, in the evening was when I saw that I was included in a message like in the evening. And it was literally an invitation to like a launch. And I mean, it's all good and great. Happy that you're launching something. I would love to be there. I mean, I'm supporting you, but just like no kind of message to say um, I'm really sorry um, or something. You know, we have plans today, right? You, you, you know, like, I got stuff to do and I kind of scheduled everything around doing that, around like going out. But yeah, um, I have not heard from this person at all. No message about going out. It's like I made plans with myself and that's just like so crazy. That's why I really just be by myself, y'all. Like I really just be by myself and I don't, I don't be trying to do people. Like it's just crazy because people are just so weird. But tomorrow though, guys, I'm supposed to be going to breakfast let, slash, no, it's not breakfast anymore. It's gonna be lunch because we couldn't get a reservation until like 2 15 the other reservation was at 8 a.m <laughs> ain't no way ain't no way and this place is in miami so another influencer another influencer lord god I, like i don't know about this another influencer um she is from um she has jamaican heritage or whatever and she's american but she's so cool like we've been talking online and then i'm just like do you want to do something and she's like yeah because we she been said we should do something but then we never got around to it but then like we was talking like yesterday and stuff and she's like let's like go have lunch because we've been said we was gonna go to brunch and she's like let's go and i'm just like i bet that sounds pretty good and how i know that shorty's serious like she facetimed me and we talked so even though i've never like met her in real life we met over facetime and we talked and it's like the it's good vibes it's not weird it's not like you know making plans into thin air with somebody that i never like you know had conversations with so that's pretty good mm -hmm. so sis booked um a reservation and how i know we're going she had to put her card on there um apparently this place if you don't show up that's 30 dollars per person that you reserve for so if we don't go it's gonna be 60 dollars. and i mean her card is on there so i'm sure she's gonna go and shout outs to keisha if you're watching this you're a real one and I can't wait to meet you tomorrow because and guys I'm sorry I just had to vent because people are so weird like I don't get how we making plans here like that's so cool yeah that sounds good let's go you have an old outfit and then just nothing and then no common decency to say something just nothing but whatever um let's move on I just got a package I'm always getting packages I just got a package from Amazon um I ordered this thing for my bathroom Hopefully y'all can see me. And guys, I think I'm gonna go ahead and order the new vlogging camera because I watched my vlog from last week. Oh my god, it's so dark. I watched my black I watched the vlog that I posted last week and I hate it and it's all on my edges, girl. I did my hair and I promised you yesterday 
it was busting it looks so good um, what I'm gonna do though is wash all the stuff out of it flat iron them yes girl I tried the flat iron edges thing <laughs> I liked it because it turned out cute. I don't really care that much to say, okay, um, you're gonna make your edges drop out. My edges always drop out anyway, so it don't matter. And it looked real cute, so tomorrow, because I wanna be cute, I'm gonna wash this out later. I'm gonna straighten them and I'm gonna just do some really cute edges. So yeah, um, I bought this for my shower. The last time I bought a shower caddy, I returned it because I did not like how it looked. I, I, don't, I, I don't like seeing like the thing hanging off the, um, the shower so I got these these are supposed to go on the wall oh and they're in matte black which I think is going to be such an aesthetically pleasing vibe like look at this you know what? let me turn the other light on because it's so dark in here damn it Florida like one minute it's bright and sunny the other minute it's just like dark and raining yeah so I got these they're supposed to go on the wall don't you think they look real good like the aesthetic is going to be nice because it's matte like a matte black and then it's not gonna be hanging over the shower head so I'm gonna see how those work and I have two of them and it has a sticky thing I think I don't know I bought two more of the glass jars that I have like the ones in my kitchen I'm gonna use those in the bathroom I'm gonna use them in my bathroom because I need like soap dispensers. So I think I'm just gonna use this in the bathroom. I don't know if I'm gonna put the label on it. And I'm wondering if I should do like the two bottles or just one because I'm the only person that goes in that bathroom anyways. But I love them. They look so, oh my God. They look so good. Like they look really good and they come with their own like labels that say hand soap. Um, yeah, hand soap. What else? Hand soap, hand lotion, dish soap, and shampoo. I only wanted it for hand soap, so it's only like one hand soap label, but that's totally fine. Bruh, if my camera don't focus, dang. Okay, so the camera that I was trying to get is a Sony camera. They have it at Best Buy, so shoot. I'm gonna just order it online because they didn't have it in the store. So I'm just gonna order it online myself. Guys, I'm so excited for the coffee table. Yo, my maintenance manager is the best. Like I love him. They're always helping me. Ooh. So I'm gonna open it up to see. We don't have no carpet yet because the carpet is not ready, but I'm just really excited to see what this looks like. Oh, I'm nervous. Oh my God. Cause I don't want to have to return anything, but let's see. Y'all, this is what it looks like. Um, it says, pull red ribbon for floor tip. I don't know. Ooh. Oh, I guess that should go in the bottom. Um, so I'm just gonna finish setting it up and then um, I'm gonna show you. Guys, so this is a coffee table. 
it's me like sitting down just staring at it not my if i like it it's very low so this is me on the couch i mean i don't want it like way up in the air where it looks it's looking funny but it's so low when i stand up it looks really low but when i sit in the chair it looks perfect um yeah then it's me just deciding if i want this or not because if i don't love it i'm returning it because it was not cheap like these drum coffee tables i don't know if the wood on it or what they'd be like five six hundred dollars um i saw this on another website for like six something and i ended up searching around and i found this one for it was five five hundred i think it was not overstock so i got it at a better rate but i don't know how i feel i'm literally sitting in the chair do you see how dirty i am that's all the things that was on the coffee table it's real wood so it, it had a lot of like shavings and stuff like dust or whatever so i'm literally sitting in the sofa trying to decide if this is my portion in life i don't know how i feel and i feel like um because i don't have a rug it made it makes it even worse like it's looking so ugly just on the floor so maybe that's what's bothering me i don't know i'm gonna check to see if how long the return window is if i can wait to get my rug and then test it out with the rug to see if i'm going to i'm gonna pack up all the stuff ignore those those are the pots for the plants but when the rain falls the water is settling in them so i feel like i have to return those but yeah i don't know i'm gonna clean up this area vacuum a little bit fluff my sofa up and see how i feel i wish i had the carpet so i could get a better idea as to what it's gonna look like guys so i got my curtains hung in the living room the rod was shorter than i had anticipated so i have ordered a longer one i might move it i'm still not sure i kind of like it i kind of don't i'm still not sure i might use the longer rod and extend it but i love the coffee table and how everything is looking the place looks really eerie and bright and i'm just waiting on the carpet you all so i had to show y'all my new camera i got the sony zv1 that it's like the new it camera for vlogging um i got the vlogging kit with it so it brings the tripod and the different things to control the camera as well as you get like a memory card and uh, this is the camera i'm super excited to use it i feel like it's gonna up my quality i wanted to get the canon g7x mark iii well not wanted to i was like uh in between y'all because i like the quality of the zv1 and i also 
saw someone's video and they were using the Canon G7X Mark III and it was immaculate. But let's see how this works out. Um, yeah, right now I'm vlogging on my G7X Mark II, which I don't love. As y'all know, if you've been watching me, I've been complaining, then stop about it. Um, today's the day of and y'all, I went ahead and got myself back a Rouge. Rouge. Like, I've been wanting to get me this perfume. I love the smell. Like, the box is just cute. I had to show y'all. I don't care. Um, this is the box that comes inside. And it has this little thingy. And then you pull it out. If I can get it open. Wait. And then you pull it out. And like, ooh. Ooh, Chile, and then how's that? I had to show y'all, I don't care. It's my first ever like high-end fragrance purchase, high-end in the sense that I never buy no fragrance for 350 in my life. So here's to that. Let's go. I smell like money and baccarat. <laughs> Yo, once upon a time, I did have a Sony camera. I had the A6000, that's what it's called. Yeah, and then I sold it to somebody because I didn't really get it. Um, and then I got a Canon, but let's see if Sony is giving again. Ooh, that's a nice size, that's beautiful. Okay, now my G7X wanna show like folk. Ooh! Girl! Okay, so I brought my new camera. This is what we do over here. Yeah, I love this for me. But look at it, it's so nice and sleek. I was thinking of getting the white because everyone has the black, but girl, people will more likely notice that white versus notice a black camera. But it's pretty sleek. I have to go and like read about it, like read the manual because I don't know how it works. And this looks a little different than my previous Sony that I had. So I'm gonna go read up about it. It's typically like the same format. Like the buttons look just like my um, my Canon right here. The only difference is this, this camera goes out to the side. Oh my God, it's me looking to the side now versus looking at the top. I think that's gonna be distracting because I'm gonna be looking at myself over there. 